Hey guys, it's Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com, Infinity Custom Works, and Gary Dean Detailing. This right here is the 20 foot Sea Fox we'll be working on today. As you can see, she's got some oxidation. We're removing the numbers and I will be cutting new ones and mailing them to him so he can replace them. I'm gonna be doing some repairs on these areas right here. And this area right here. We are gonna be spraying the VersaCoat 13 on this boat. We got the lovely Tony here taking off these decals. All this is gonna come off from years prior. So you can see it just generally is oxidized and looks like poo poo, but we're gonna straighten it out. Um, Tony will be in the interior cleaning that up as well. Um, it's definitely a cleaner boat than we're used to. But you can see that level of oxidation. Uh, definitely needs some stuff on the interior, but it's not too, too bad. Um, generally, when we do Versico 13 jobs, we'll do the top surround and the hull. Unless you ask about it. So the package on the website for $125 a linear foot will include a full detail inside. So it's it's all of everything plus polishing and ceramic on the interior. But that 125 includes just the hull, the transom, and this top rail in VersaCoat 13. So, all right, you've seen it. Time to get to work. All right, my favorite people, my YouTube fam. This side is all prepped and ready. Look at the uh, lovely Tony up there taking a break from this crazy heat. She's up there kicking butt on that interior while I'm out here working on these, this exterior. You probably remember how bad the oxidation was on this hull, especially the blue part. You couldn't really tell on the white. Um, I have a brand new oxalate, it, well, I released an oxi oxidation delete prep scrub last year in my pro marine series line and we've changed the formula because i wanted something that worked faster easier and just overall better and so as you can see i got all the oxidation off now yet yeah, you're probably saying well it's not it's still chalky well it's not chalky it is it is just dull if you will this oxidation delete prep scrub actually has an abrasive in it and a chemical cleaner that will make your life easier. Uh, this literally is basically completely prepped. I use the um, oxidation delete prep scrub with a towel. It was a powder before. Now it's a liquid that you put on a microfiber towel and you work it in. So. It's easier to use, less mess, and just functions better. And so that's obviously always what you want. So where I'm at now is I got this one already prepped. The transom and the other side are already prepped as well. I just don't have the masking done uh, on that side. So I'm, I'm literally getting ready to spray it on this side, spray the VersaCoat 13. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that all ready to go and then i'm going to go ahead and shoot this i'm going to go ahead and cover up these uh portholes or the um the holes for the bilge pump uh for the rear there and then there's one in the front that might just be a drain not for a bilge the bilge is generally in the back all right well i'm gonna go ahead and get rolling catch you on the flip side all right my peeps this side has been sprayed with two coats of VersaCoat 13. Um, I had, so normally I would use my Fuji Mini Mite 5 Platinum 
for a mobile job, but I decided to give that electric sprayer a go. And I really just like it because it's simple and effective. And so I sprayed this whole side and it was a little bit heavy. So I got a couple of runs and some sags. Um, I also had a, a lighter spot, this piece. I just added more material. You can see it's a little dry around it. I'm gonna be able to sand that out and polish it and it'll look great. I ended up having to add just a little bit more material to that section as well, but look at, most of it looks amazing. Um, I attribute the runs, and look, I, I am not the best at this yet, but every time I do this, I get better at it. And as you can see, this boat was in horrible shape, and now it looks better than brand new people. And this shine should never go away. Should stay, but you, know, you, you never know. Environmental factors, I mean, you never know if like acid rain is gonna fall from the sky and it's going to be the acid rain that burns everything up, lights it on fire, you don't know. But I can tell you that VersaCo 13 was designed to never go away. So we are gonna have to come back for day two because we're just, it's like 3.30 and we just, we're gonna work for a couple more hours, but uh, should have some rain coming through this afternoon. So we're gonna get the other side sprayed and the transom sprayed and probably gonna pack it up for the day. We'll come back tomorrow and then this, the hull should be cured enough for me to go ahead and sand out and polish the spots that um, don't look ideal. And uh, we'll be good to go. But wow, what a difference. Wow. All right, guys, I am gonna keep on keeping on. It's time to go. I gotta mask up the transom and the other side and get that shot so that we can break out, come back tomorrow and get this bad boy finished up. Talk at you soon. All right, say hi, lovely Tony. Are you tired of working on this boat yet? Done. We're done. All right, it's complete, guys. It's pretty beautiful. What did we do to this thing? Everything. But like what, though, specifically? Why did we do this boat? They call this thing? Because it was all oxidized, needs to be repaired. We came and fixed it with VersaCo 13. Come on, be optimistic. All right, so uh, all of the things I just said, because she wouldn't say them. Boat looks awesome now. Like a new boat again, like it should after a two whole day detail. I mean, we literally polished everything in this thing. You can see how the gunnels are all glossy. Interior is looking fantastic. We got all the compartments all cleaned out. The live well over there cleaned. Um, I hand polished all of the stainless everywhere. Even the rub rail I uh, polished. Uh, I did notice that my new uh, oxidation delete prep scrub worked awesome to remove uh, the nastiness that was on this uh, stainless steel bumper around here. So that's cool. Pretty happy with that. Boat looks great. Interior looks great. Yeah, buddy. 2010 Sea Fox. 20 so 206 center console looking good look at that gloss gloss all right guys thank you so much for listening to me babble and watching these videos i appreciate you taking the time check out detailjuice.com for all your product needs uh, if i can assist you in your detailing endeavors 813-846-4406 is my cell I'm Gary, I am the owner. When you reach out to that cell phone number, you get me with the real answers.
So if you need me, let me know. Check me out on Instagram, which is gary.dean.35. I'll put that right here. And well, you see it, Versacoat 13 worked awesome. Um, when you do a boat outside, it is incredibly important that you do your spraying out of direct sunlight. So generally with a boat like this, um, there's a Eastern, Western or Northern and Southern side. So you would do the first side while it's all in the shade and figure out your orientation uh, per where the sun is and move the boat accordingly if you need to or switch sides to get it done properly. You don't want to spray in direct sunlight because the sun will prematurely cure the VC-13 before it has a chance to flow out. You want it to flow and not produce orange peel, so don't do it in direct sunlight. Anyway, I used only 32 ounces of Versacoat 13 in clear. We didn't add any pearls today. We just wanted to bring back the gloss on this semi-neglected old boat. It was a clean boat when we got here, but it was still crazy oxidized. But it is not anymore. And uh, I'm pretty proud of the fact that on this entire 20 foot boat, we only used 32 ounces on all of the hull and the transom. Boom shakalaka. Looks awesome. Very happy with it. Anyway, thank you guys for watching these videos. And if you got questions for me, let me know. Boy, I could stand here and look at this thing all day long. Looks like it needs to be at the boat dealer for sale as a big brand new boat. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching guys. If you have interest in Versacoat 13 Pre, please reach out. Again, my cell phone number is 813-846-4406. Have a great day, guys.